Hello everyone, how are you today? So, yeah, you all know what is actually happening around the world. Coronavirus, pandemic, outbreak, everywhere. And people are stockpiling food and all that. But, let me ask you a question. Is it all food you can actually stockpile? No, there's some perishable food you cannot stockpile. So I just want to show you how to preserve your food. And you can preserve it as long as you want. And when you're ready to cook, yeah, just take it out from your freezer and you cook it and yeah, you're good to go, okay? So, I'm going to show you how I'm going to preserve my okra soup. Sorry, okra, not yet cooked, so it's okra. So this is my okra. So what I usually do to preserve my okra, like I recently cooked okra soup and um, I, I actually preserved it for about three months before I cooked it and it was still good, it was still tasty, it was still okra, the way okra is supposed to taste. So what I would do now is I'm going to wash my okra, you know you need to wash it and um, Just wash your okra and once I wash my okra the next thing I will do is I'm going to um, chop it off chop off the parts that we do not eat so sorry for the commotion <laughs> so I'm just going to chop up this actually to make it faster I'm going to do it in batches right and um, yeah, just to make it faster because you cannot just blend one up at a time, so it take so much time. So, this part that is not edible. I don't know if it's edible or not, but usually we take we don't cut that part. So I'm going to chop off all those bits and then chop it into small smaller bits and then I cut it ready for for blending. So what I do is I blend my okra. Okay, I blend my okra. So I'm going to do that for all of the okra. I'm going to take out all of this bits. In your okra, then you put some water so that you can blend it. Um, then you. Okra. Depends on how smooth you want it. I don't usually like my okra smooth, too smooth, so I'll just let it. Yeah, so that is what I do. I'll just blend my okra, uh, blend it a little bit, and I put it in a container so I can refrigerate it, okay? So this is what I do to actually preserve my okra. So you can leave this in the refrigerator for as long as you want to. And when you're ready to cook your okra, you just take it from the refrigerator and then you blend it and then you're good to go. Rather than you leaving your okra like this and then it begins to turn bad, it begins to go bad, you understand? So like we bought this like this one for a week now, I've not had time to blend it. So. Uh, you see it's already getting dark and before you know it is to get um spoiled so this is the best way to preserve your okra once you're not ready to cook it just do it this way and then you can leave it for as long as you want to and your okra is good to go all right so thank you for watching my video i'm going to be bringing you another way of preserving another kind of food okay till i see you another time take care for now bye